Hello YouTubers, beer geeks, and beer hounds alike. Bill here. We're going to do an epic beer battle. Domestic beer battle. We got... We got Mike Tyson and Muhammad Ali, okay? Miller High Life, Budweiser, the king of beers, supposedly. We'll be the judge of that, me, myself, and I, okay? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pour them in the glasses, identical glasses. The only thing that's different is this one right here. It's got blue tape on the bottom, okay? So um, I'm going to put red, old red here, Budweiser, in the blue tape glass. And Miller High Life, the cult following beer, into the no tape glass, okay? So let's, uh, let's do this. Um, I'll do the Miller first, just to be fair, because Miller is the current champ right now, the domestic champ, and like, you know, North America champ. So uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do a hard pour just for the, no, actually soft pour, because uh, I don't want to be able to tell if there's a difference in the head, because I did that before, and I could tell which one was which, because I'm going to blind my, blindfold myself. And um, I don't want to be able to guess because whatever one has a bigger head is going to touch my lips first. You know what I mean? So there's the uh, Miller High Life in the no tape uh, glass, okay? And then we're going to crack the old butt wiper here and put it in uh, the glass with the blue tape, okay? We'll try to do an easy pour here. This is an epic domestic uh beer battle here because uh, these two are this one claims to be the king of beers okay domestic beers and this one claims to be the champagne of beers so we'll see which one's better here a little bit more in this one here okay so um i'll put these off to the side so they don't get tangled up when i uh mix them up here okay the microphone a little bit there all right hopefully that still sounds good there we go. All right, so it um, looks like the both basically have no head, pretty much the same in the head department. Um, let me get my tweaker light here, get an eye on this, get a gander on it with some light. All right, so um, the Miller's got a little bit bigger bubbles, and they're a little bit shooting up faster, a little quicker. Um, shoot, let me get a thumbnail here real quick. All right. You guys can stand next to each other there, okay, without fighting. There. All right. All right. Dude, sorry about that, but you gotta do what you gotta do, you know what I'm saying? So what I'm gonna do is just pour a little bit more, get a little head on the top of these guys here. Come on. Alright. Yeah, that didn't work. Oh well. It is what it is, right? Alright, there we go. Alright. Quick little photo op here of the two alleged kings. Right. Nope, not that one. There. There it is. All right. So, whoa, what are you doing? All right, let's uh, get them about face again. So uh, it looks like the Budweiser is a little, just a touch darker, possibly, I think. But uh, the, um, the Miller's got a little more activity going, bigger bubbles, looks a little bit more um, carbonated for sure. As far as color goes, they're really close. I think the Budweiser is just a hair darker, though, just a hair. So I'm going to put my blindfold on and um, mix these puppies up. Don't, don't forget Budweiser's blue tape. 
Miller High Life is no tape, okay? I'm going to blindfold myself, mix them up, drink them, and uh, pick which one I think I like better, okay? Blind taste test here. In the middle of Hurricane uh, Hillary. Yeah. There I can't see nothing. Okay. So I'll mix these up and I'll smell them and then drink them. And then uh, we'll see which one the beer hound likes more. I like both beers. Um, I, I, From what I... Yeah, I think I like Miller a little bit more than Bud. I've drank both of them quite a bit. And um, I always gravitate more towards Miller. <clears throat> but a blind taste test, we'll see if those uh, me doing that, gravitating more towards Miller is the right thing or was I just all in my head? You know what I'm saying? Or did the cult get me with voodoo, the Miller cult, Miller highlight cult? cult people that say this is the best beer in the galaxy miller high life but there's a lot of budweiser king of beer pretty much cult following too that would protest that so i have no idea which beer is which here okay so um i'm gonna go ahead and uh, go with my the one on my left your right first i must smell it I don't smell anything hardly at all. This one I'm getting a little bit of something. Some kind of little earthy note. This one I'm getting a slight sweetness though. Okay. So I'm gonna take a sip of the sweat this one here first. Okay, now this one. Okay. I like to take a guess. Okay. I'm just going to guess that this is the Budweiser and this is the Miller. Okay. I'm just guessing. <clears throat> All right. It's pretty fucking good, man. Both of them. They're both good. Try to be honest here. Honest as I can be, man. This one's a little smoother, actually. <clears throat> but this one's got a nice crispness to it. Um, nice zestiness on the tongue. This one's a little more creamy and smoother. I like the taste of this one more, though. Both good. Very similar in taste, though. I'm just going by enjoyability here.
damn, they almost taste identical. Identical. The really, really difference is the mouthfeel, man. They're so similar tasting, though. That's a trip. Fucking hey, man. This is tough. I'm telling you right now. These two are really tasting good right now. And it's really hard to... They both are different, but... In their own ways. But I'm trying to figure out which difference I like better. <clears throat> Excuse me. Nothing but foam. <clears throat> there. Okay. This one definitely is holding up better. <clears throat> this one's getting a little flat. A little more, you know, flatter. And this one's still alive. Mm, God, they both taste really good, though. Is taste department, man, hang on. I like this one just slightly more. So what I'm going to do is kind of chug a little bit here and see how that feels. Okay, I got it. I know which one I like more. That was fuck flapping tough, man. That was tough, man. But I got to give it to this one because the flavor is just slightly better. I mean, like a hair better. And I kind of go for this one a little more because it stayed more zesty longer. This one got started getting a little flat. A little bit, okay. Little this one was more creamy, but this one just had a slight better mouthfeel, I think. It was a little more resilient over time and had just slightly, just ever so slightly better taste. Okay. Yeah, it's just got a little tiny bit more going on in all departments. Okay. This one. And I, I think it's this. I think this one is Miller. That's what I think. So I'm going to take my blindfold off now. We're fitting to find out, okay? Oh, my God. Ugh. Please tell me I was recording. Yes, okay. Well, I drank that one more, too. That one coming. Excuse me. Okay, so. Um, Budweiser's blue tape. Miller was no tape. I like this one more. No tape. Miller for the win. What can I say? It is what it is, man. So there's your winner. Chicken dinner. Now I gotta drink these suckers. So thank you for stopping by. You know what to do. Hit the big three. Like, subscribe, hit the little bell for notifications. Appreciate y'all. Miller still the champ, the domestic champ. Of the adjunct land adjunct beer land so uh you all have a great day and uh i can't see everything's blurry because the blindfold and uh stay tuned for a beer review and a, and a recovery update all right you have a great day later <laughs>